hello guys you're welcome to my channel you're welcome to another video so in this video today i'll be talking about how to start a pre-order business how to start pre-order like a pro that is what i'll be talking about in this video so if this sounds like something you want to watch more of or you want to learn about then you should make sure you watch to the end don't click out and subscribe and join the family join ray nation all right guys let's go straight to what we have today but before that my name is rachel nabon and on this channel we talk about anything that adds value to you we create educational entertaining and informative um content on this channel so don't forget to turn on bell notification you get notified whenever i upload new videos and give this video a thumbs up it costs nothing it's free of charge all right so what is pre-order so i've been getting a lot of questions about pre-order have you made a video about pre-order but i don't know i think the sound was bad so i have to take it down i have to delete that video and today i want to create another video to answer all your questions all right so what is pre-order pre-order is just starting a business without a capital that is that is what it means starting a business without capital yes i know on this channel you must have watched one or two of my videos where i mentioned that you can actually start a, a business without capital and this is one of those kind of business it's called pre-order so i'm going to explain how this works where you can pre-order from and ways to become a pro that is if you want to venture into this kind of business that is what this video is all about today so as i've mentioned before pre-order is starting up a business without a capital how do you do that all right so you see people upload pictures of products on their status and they said pre-order price is this pre-order price is that so why people do that is because if you're doing pre-order you you're going to get those products cheaper than when the product arrives and you don't know what is behind that right so, so what is behind that is the fact that you will pay for the product before it arrives and they use your money to buy those products and deliver to you that's the reason why it's cheaper so if they use their money to buy the products and sell to you they are going to sell you at the exact price so that is how that is being done it's a two-way thing you as a consumer you get to buy things cheaper and you as a seller you get to start up a business without a capital because you're using your customers money to buy those products mind you these customers are aware that you're using your money their money to buy the product right though some of them wouldn't know but that is how it's been done because you will need to inform them that see it's not arriving immediately it might take it might take some time all right so your you as a buyer you as a vendor you are actually um buying with people's money starting up your own business with people's money and at the end you make profit from it and this profit you're making from the pre-order business you can use it to start up your own business so that is how it is do you like it do you like what this sounds like okay let's go ahead let's go ahead but for me to go ahead i would like you to comment go ahead in the comment section okay i get that all right so let's go okay so you've seen people upload pictures on their status on their um, pages instagram pages or social media pages about products even on youtube here people upload videos talking about products that you can place order for based on pre-order you've seen that yes and you want to start something like that okay just relax because i'm going to tell you more on how to do that so this is how it's been done being a pre-order vendor or starting up a pre-order business is sweet right that is if you know the basics around it knowing the basics about pre-order business will help you not to lose money because i know a lot of persons have started pre-order and they lost money that's because they never did their calculation right they never did their calculation right okay so you're going to know that in this video as well all right so how do you start a pre-order business where do you get products from where do you get pictures from okay you can start a pre-order business in different ways you can decide to import your items that is buying from international market or you buy from local market or buying from instagram and facebook vendors 
okay how do you do this first of all you go to instagram or facebook and search for vendors that are into this business the business that you want to go into and you discuss with them get pictures of their product and advertise on your own page so when people order for you can go to those people pay buy and deliver to your customers yes the vendor might be selling at three thousand you can decide to advertise on your own page for four thousand so at least you will get one thousand naira as your profit yes or whatever currency you're using all right so that is how it's been done then if you want to go internationally right you can go into importation so i have tons of videos about importation on this channel you can go through those courses right and if you still don't understand you can reach out to me i'm going to drop the link to my instagram handle in the description you can reach out to me chat me up or you check here check at the top here you'll see my name rachel nabon that's the same name on facebook and the same name on instagram so you can find me there and chat me up if you want if you want um a special class like a one-on-one -on -one class to learn importation yes i am an importation coach i'm also a procurement coach i'm also a procurement agent so that is not a problem at all you got covered i got you covered right here okay so you can check out those videos and learn how to import things from 1688 from alibaba so when you learn how to import these things what you need to do okay let's say after your classes that is if you decide to go for the paid class yes if you are coming to me it's a paid class it's not free but the videos you see here they are free videos so you can watch those ones but if you're coming to me just know that you're coming for a paid class right i have different classes that you can afford they are really really affordable so you um after you've learned your importation everything about importation what you need to do next is to search for the products that you want remember while learning your importation you need to know how to calculate everything everything and i mean everything you don't just see prices on the site and you decide to give that price to your customers or you even add your own profit and give to your customers no there are a lot of things that you need to put in place there is local shipping there that you need to add there is international shipping right there is international shipping there is local delivery like way b so you need to include all of this in your calculations and know how to fix your prices right that is number one thing that you need to do all right so when you do that you create a group a whatsapp group or you use your whatsapp story your whatsapp status your instagram story your facebook story and advertise these products all right so you have a timeline for this product you can give them like two weeks to place order you keep posting pictures and their prices you can include the shipping fee there or you can do when all order comes you include shipping fee anyone that suits your customers anyone that you feel is okay for you you do that all right post these pictures post pictures and their prices and give a time frame let's say you want to you want to give them like one week to make payment so when they make payment you inform them the shipping method you're using you could use a or c a or c so if you're using a and it's 14 days you inform them that oh this is going to take 14 days to arrive this is going to take 14 days to arrive so what you need to do is to inform them that see payment is for one week then the next day you can start counting your 14 days because those that paid on the first day of your payment date will start counting their 14 days from there which will put more pressure on you and you don't need that pressure sweetheart you don't need that pressure because you're with people's money so you have to state out all these rules before they make payment make them understand that you start counting your two weeks or your three months a day after your own deadline the deadline you've given to them make this clear to them to avoid drama to avoid drama okay so once that is done once the date is over you make payment to a procurement agent if you've taken importation costs and you can do it on your own then you go ahead and place order make payment but if you haven't taken importation course you meet your procurement agent which i can serve as a procurement agent for you if you're interested at an affordable rate yes you can come to me and send me your links and your descriptions and i will help you make payment you pay your currency you pay whatever currency you're using into my account and i will in turn pay your chinese suppliers in their currency 
So when the goods comes, you deliver to them and you make profits from it. That sounds interesting, right? Yes. The next thing you will need to do before you even start advertising whatever product you're advertising, make sure you add your profits. Make sure you add your profits. This stands as your charge. The stress that you will go through, the shouts that they will come and shout when it's not yet time. You give them two weeks and they're already coming after one week to ask how is it going? How far has it been delivered? So this um this charge you're adding serves as your own as your own profit. It's from this charge that you will start up your own business. You gather your capital, right? So you can as well add one thousand, two thousand, depending on how your conscience judge you to add the money and it's going to be fine yes so if you don't do your calculation right you're going to end up using your money to buy for them so you have to do your calculation right that's one of the reasons why i always advise that you enroll for importation training before doing these things because in the class you're going to learn how to do all these things all by yourself okay that is all about pre-order business pre-order business is really a cool business if you ask me it's a cool business it's something that if you have nothing to start with of recently i've been getting a lot of students coming to my dm they are final year students they want to start up something i'll advise you start pre-order but before you go into pre-order know all the rudiments of pre-order know everything that you need to know if it means saving up to enroll for a course so you don't make mistakes then it's fine i know of most of my students that are into pre-order business and they are doing very well right now and they keep having different badges yes people are making money don't be deceived by what people are saying out that oh dollar rate is high yes we know dollar rate is high but people are still cashing out so you too can cash out you need to start up something this year you really need to start up something this year let capital not be an excuse for not starting up a business this year i have explained to you what you need to do so if you put this in practice guys before december you're going to become one of the biggest girls in town so that is what i stop by here to tell you drop a comment if this video was helpful let me know in the comment if there's a question that you want me to answer if there's a video you want me to make then go ahead and drop a comment and let's see how to handle that all right guys i have to stop here until i come your way again my name is rachel nabon your favorite importation coach bye